Hey guys, it's me Daisy. Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be doing my fall house tour, but before we get into it, I just want to say that my house is pretty much going to stay the same throughout, like, the whole, like, time that I have it. I might change it, but, you know, I literally just changed the wallpapers, floors, and added a couple decorations for, you know, spooky season. And also, I will not be posting very regularly because... I have a guest and they're staying in my guest room and I usually film in there because I don't really have time or, or a place to film anywhere else. So I'm just trying to find some time to film and so yeah. So starting with the outside, over here as you can see I have these pumpkins and a little table which I just thought was cute. I put a couple things, obviously the doorbell and I have this in our old house as well. Welcome to our happy home. And that candle usually would be on, except there's a ghost decoration, so, you know, kind of flammable. And then, just a little mailbox in here, I kept some little decor. Which is pretty nice. So, coming into the house, we start with the entrance, mudroom, laundry room, whatever you want to call it. Um, uh, these are, like, some stuff, I don't really have anything on this top drawer. But we have this in our old house as well. It's just a nice way to, like, look at how you're doing, put your shoes on, you know, just, like, before you leave the house. Because, obviously, you don't want to leave the house looking like a mess. And if you want to, like, use a mirror, we have mirrors, obviously. But, like, it's just a nice to have one right in front. And hand sanitizer, because every time we come from somewhere, we have to use hand sanitizer. We have our keys. Now, we don't have, like, um, the same alarm system in this house, but it's okay because we still do have an alarm system. It's just different from our last house. It's just not visible, basically. Now, this is our laundry machine. It's not, like, a lot, but it's just, like, it's kind of just a small area. And as you can see, we have a very busy month, as you can see from the um, monthly planner. I bought that, and I thought it was really cute. And now I'm just going to quickly go over the aesthetic items of this room. So, as you can see, I have this hand sanitizer from the hospital. The keys are from the studio apartment. Um, yeah, sorry. Keys are from the studio apartment. And the, um, this apple is from the university. These towels are from the Watermelon Wave Club. And that's pretty much it for this room. Um, everything else is build mode, probably. Okay, moving on to the elevator area uh as you can see this is the elevator pretty similar i got a different plant though uh we have our like bench with some cushions and this is just for like fun we put this little keep out poster um <laughs> yeah it was pretty cute as you can see i have some decorations around here and um over here we also have the um little bag area so up here we have really nice lunch bags which were gifts Camry's backpack, which is from the university. Um, my bag, which is from the Bottom Line Wave Club, and my wallet from the movie studio, and my credit card from the Pom Pom Emporium, I'm pretty sure. And these two backpacks, Lily and Nate's backpacks, are from the Chili Buns. This area is pretty cool, and I like it a lot. I think I'm really happy with the way it turned out. I don't know why the rug isn't centered. I'll fix that later. <laughs> All right, moving into the living room area. So, oh, I didn't know those were lights. Oh my god, anyway. So, like, this is our living room area. And as you can see, we have our little basket of CDs. Um, some books, just because they're cute. We don't have a copy table here, actually. But we do have these big shelves, which I quite like. Um, so, yeah. I think most of the stuff from here is from uh, Belmo as well. But the CDs, if you go to, like, that, like, grocery store, the lemon one. Uh, and you use the little gumball machine thing, you can get CDs, and these are from just random places around the map. Um, this little thing is from the winter cabin, and this is also from the winter cabin. Other than that, everything is from build mode, I'm pretty sure. Oh, and this is a gift. This candle is a gift. Okay, moving on. This is my office area. So I wanted to have a kind of a separate office area because I just like having... My own space to do my work, so there's a lot of different items in this place, which I'll have to go over in a second. 
I have another one of these ghost lights. We have a lot of these placed throughout the house. This tape from the university, this from the um, apartments. This is also from the university, and yeah, it's all pretty cute. Um, over here, this is from the... These two are from the haunted house, and this is from the uh, university, or there's like a guy holding it, like the horse thing. And this is from, I'm pretty sure, the hotel gift shop. This beanbag chair is from the... Um, what's it called? Uh, the chili buns, yes. So yeah, and then I always put cute pictures of the kids up in my desk area, so I'm reminded of them while I work. And I got this cute little Halloween bucket and this old candle, and I put the candle inside the Halloween bucket. And it creates this cute little candle holder. And then we have a heater in case it gets kind of chilly, because I get really cold. And yeah. Alright, moving on to the kitchen space. So, as you can see here, I have a good old, like, coffee machine i love coffee i have it every morning so does justin we're coffee people not really tea people but we do like tea um and yeah this is just our coffee supplies that we keep down here and yeah our microwave coffee machine i got this cute little um acorn little holder for in case we need to put something in there and i got this cool candelabra um if you don't have the messy cottage you can also get a really similar one like this from the um what's it called oh my god the morning one baker i keep forgetting what things are called and these like really cute pumpkin tea set which i really needed like i needed that <laughs> it was so cute i had to get it for the house and um oh my god it just always glitches oh yeah my house is full but yeah so over here okay so over here yeah i have to fix that over there so um i have like little thing with our peanut butter our chocolate spread um this is another little holder this is a pumpkin though and these are i'm pretty sure are from the winter cabin these towels um other than that everything in here is pretty much from different build packs in build mode um yeah and then here i keep pots and pans and down here snacks don't tell the kids um in the fridge i'm really happy with how the fridge turned out pretty much the same grocery store for the milk and these are from the farmer's market. And this little apron I have for when I like cook is from the daycare. Okay, so now we're gonna head on to the backyard. The kids were super excited. We finally have a backyard. The grass usually is greener, but you know, it's fall. So the grass is a little, little yellowish. But out here we have a nice table and the flowers are also looking a bit yellowish because it's fall. Um, but, you know, we'll replace them in summer. And over, you can see there's a lot of fallen leaves because there's quite a few trees around the area. I want a nice little seating area for the kids. This is where we'll hang up our laundry. Um, over here, we have just a little, little tree house that Nate wanted. It's not very tall because I didn't want them to fall and get hurt. And this little basket has some toys and also has their sleeping bags because they want to do a sleepover out here. I don't think they will. They're going to get scared, but if they ever decide to. And these are the Leonid scooters from the activity house. So I guess we should move upstairs. Okay, so now we're here on the second floor. And as you can see, this area is pretty similar. Over here, I just have some stuff for Oreo and Frenchie. Frenchie's sleeping. Frenchie's getting a bit old. Um, so, you know, she's sleeping a lot. And Oreo, wide awake, as usual. Um, let's go over here to the bathroom first. I was a bit skeptical. Oh, there's a bathroom on the floor. Um, I was a bit skeptical at first of having to share a whole bathroom as a family. But I think we made it work pretty well because it's a pretty big space. I love the shower. I mean, the bath area. I think it's so cute definitely gonna have a lot of relaxing baths here and over here we have our toothbrushes bathrobes mouthwash all that stuff and then down here i have an extra toothbrush my gua sha and my jade roller uh, we have a nice shower and this is just some fun area and all my skincare products um all of these are from the new get glossy pack but these are from the mall um 
and yeah pretty much that's all for the bathroom by the way um this purple toothbrush is from the hotel these towels are a gift these bathrooms are also a gift dentist office um and the jade roller and guasha are a gift so back in the hallway um yeah i just added some decor obviously it doesn't usually look like this um it's just for fall and in this house they were pretty excited they finally got their own rooms so let's show you the rooms so this is lily's room it's a bit messy i just had her pick these up um actually by the way all the kids are out so i could film this house tour um yeah it's a bit messy but you know lily needs toys which there are a lot so i'm just gonna say they're mostly from the hospital the pom-pom emporium and the cabin uh yeah and these are their drawers but just their stuff and, and here they have their ipad lily really wanted skincare and lily like she's a kid i bought her some moisturizer and some deodorants and she's so happy uh, <laughs> um and yeah, so these are fake candles, if you're wondering. I don't want to have candles in Lily's room. And yeah, I put some really cute decor up there. And they just have each a nice chair and a desk where they can sit and do their work. Moving on to Nate's room. Also, we did actually want to keep their rooms right next to each other. So Nate's room is a bit smaller, as you can see. And the reason Nate's room is smaller is because Nate picked the smaller room. If, I don't know why, but he said he would spend more time outside because we had a backyard now so he was gonna pick the smaller room so he did pick the smaller room as you can see and in here he also has his ipad uh and then here is just his drawers with his clothes and stuff and moving on oh yeah nate's room has a window so his doesn't have like pictures everywhere we have my room and justin's room and it's a little bit messy but we're gonna ignore that so coming in here we have the bed which is pretty similar and back here i have um some stuff that's just here um justin's phone and my phone by the way are both from the bit oh my god justin lost his phone i just realized that they're from the um what's it called i keep forgetting what places are called the office they're also often the office um over here, uh, also in here, we just have, like, just some random stuff. Um, over here, we have my skincare, makeup, fake vanity area. And, yeah, it's pretty nice. So, that's all my, like, actual makeup and skincare. Uh, sorry, not skincare. All my makeup. And then down here are my palettes. Um, I love my palettes. I take pride. <laughs> and this is our closet. And down here at the bottom, we have an empty thing. Some stuff is still, like, in a warehouse, but most of it is here, but we still have some stuff in the warehouse. And over here, a nice sitting area where Justin and I can just talk about our days, do some work, you know, just have a nice time. And, yeah, let's go to the final floor slash room, which is Camry's room. Also, I forgot to say aesthetic items, but there's not a lot of aesthetic items here. Just our clothes. I think everything in this room is pretty much from build mode, not gonna lie. Okay, so now we're in Camry's room. Now, Camry's room usually has a lot of LED lights on, but they're not on right now because it's not nighttime. So, over here, Camry's skincare fridge. Also, I have this really weird glitch, guys. When a character picks it up, it turns into, like, the other color. I don't I don't get it, but whatever. Um, So, this is Camry's skincare fridge. Camry is more of a skincare girl. I'm more of a, like, a makeup girl. Like, I'm not, but yeah. So, over here, keep a picture of Camry and friends. She likes to keep that there. Another one of these DIY, like, that things. Um, yeah. Uh, this is from the Pom Pom Emporium, I'm pretty sure. She has two wallets. This is her old, this is her old wallet. This is her new one. I don't know why she hasn't switched over. This is her ring light for making TikToks, I guess. Um, yeah. Her closet, which she has her purse in, her closet. She has a lot of clothes, like a lot of clothes. But we're not gonna talk about that. Um, yeah. Uh, this is really cute. I bought this a while ago. She wanted to have it in her room. It's ghost spray. It's really cute. Um, and yeah, this is from the home designer store. 
And yeah, this is just a canopy bed. Same bed and pretty much same stuff from the last house. We did add some more vines though. Um, in here she has her iPad, some extra clothes. Yes, Cameron has so many clothes. I'm I hear you. Um, in here her makeup. She's not that big on makeup, as I said before. So she just has like concealer, foundation, lip gloss, a palette, and some blush and like some other stuff. Um, and yeah, more pictures of her and her friends. I think it's so cute how she wants to have her friends all over her room. And up here she just has pumpkins and this little teddy bear, which is a gift. Um, her laptop, uh, her pencil case from the university. And this is notebook is from the Big Family Home Pack. And yeah, I think that concludes the whole house. I'm gonna just see the drawers. All the iPads are from the mall, by the way, and most of the phones are also from the mall. And in here, like, all the stuff is well mode. Um, other than that, yeah, I think that concludes our house. But what I didn't actually go over was, oh yeah, Camry's fitteds, by the way, they're all gifts. Um, I don't know if I said that. The pillows, these pillows are from the horse stable. Uh, the bench is from the movie studio, and this plant over here is from the, um, a gift. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so that concludes the house tour. Really hope you guys liked my house. This is not what my house is going to be looking like 24-7. I'm going to change it as well later on. Um, whenever summer comes around or winter comes around. This is just for fall season. Um, but... I really hope you guys enjoyed the house tour. If you have any questions about anything else that I didn't go over, please let me know in the comments below, and I will give you a like gift. What? If you have any questions about where you got anything that I didn't go over, you can always leave a comment, and I will definitely respond to your comment. Um, yeah. So that was all. This is the end of the video, and remember to like, comment, share, subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!